In my Lou, there are people who refuse to give in and give up on their dreams. You could count David Ruggieri among them. Life has taken him on an adventure, yet he never lost sight of his calling and found a way to make it happen. Art is David Ruggieri's passion. My first major was art. But years ago, I was selling drawings for $25. Life got in the way. I listened to kind of everybody, right? And that, uh, you know, I needed to have a real job. So he dropped the spray can and he went fishing. Hitchhiked to Alaska. I worked on a fishing boat and in the cannery. These days. And then I went back to school. He's an associate professor at Mizzou. So I teach the economics of healthcare. But steady work couldn't keep him from his first love. I got to give this a try because uh, uh, regret is going to be worse than, than, than the failure. And now he puts graffiti on canvas. I never really went out and spray painted on buildings or cars. I was always too afraid that I'd get caught and then my mom would kill me. There are layers to his creativity. Well, this is, uh, I bought vintage comic books. I think it just is a, is a great look. It kind of gives a different feel. And a touch of nostalgia. All my subject matter are things that uh, have a connection to me. 10 years into it and his art is taking off. There's some recognition out there. David has works on display in cities nationwide. This piece here is going to a gallery in uh, the Lower East Side in New York. Pieces have sold for thousands of dollars. It's humbling when somebody, you know, gives me their hard-earned money because they like a piece so much that they want to hang it in their house. He may not be ready to go full-time as an artist. I do this at nights and weekends. But. It's been a good ride. He's okay with that. It's going in the right direction and uh, it's important not to stop now. Knowing that he never lost sight of his dream. I always wanted to be an artist. Giving that dream a second chance. I always tell my students, you know, you gotta, you have to follow your dreams and you have to, you have to do, you know, your passion. About David's work or find out where his art will be displayed in the future, we will provide a link when the story is posted later this morning under the Ask Seed on TV tab on KSDK.com.